Thank you for joining us for Java and Jewelry with Jamie and Jaylin. Today we're excited to show you how to be, um, we're going to continue showing you how to be smart shoppers and we're going to show you some of our favorite pieces. Um, I'm going to start out showing you our necklace that's called Passionista. It is a long necklace so again if you want to look taller and slender have fun with long necklaces. They're also wonderful. Maybe as you're going to give a gift for somebody who might have a problem with clasps. Long necklaces are great to just toss on and not worry about the clasp. So I'm going to show you um, how you can wear this necklace in one of our magnetic slide enhancers. You'll get seven different ways to wear these. So number one, and she'll keep track here. So this is one way, number one. So we're going to take this necklace and then I'm going to take the extender because what you're going to see with Premier Design Story um, the necklaces, most of them have an extender, so we can lengthen it if you need more room for your neck or the kind of shirt you're wearing. So with it longer, I'm going to take one of our clippets, and we're going to grab it near the clasp. I'm going to reach behind the neck, and we're going to clasp it in place. So clip it. There we go. Number two. Number two. Then we're going to take the slide that's called Silver Swirl. This is one of my top selling slides. What I like about our these, they have the hinge, so a magnetic hinge um, closure, if you will. So I'm going to put that right over the beads, which is nice, and you don't have to worry about sliding it side to side. You can go right over the bead. So how many is that? That's three looks. Yay! All right, here we go. You want more? <laughs> but wait, there's more. <laughs> there's always more. There's always more. So then we're going to unhook the clasp. We're going to hang on to it by the lobster claw clasp closure. Reach out and grab the beads. So hang on to the beads. We're going to put that behind your neck and then come down here to the sides and you're going to grab the closure and then the extender. We're going to cross over in front of you, so crisscross applesauce. This is very similar too to how we showed you how to triple your necklace with a clip it, how you have the two things that you just crisscross and bring them behind. Perfect. So now you're going to see framing, we're going to teach you something it's going to be shorter and then something longer. So that would be four. Number four. And then we're going to add a slide. Five. Number five. Alrighty. Do it more. Here we go. So let's unhook it. And then we'll just do the opposite. So let's just grab the coins. Lift the coins up, put those behind your neck, and the same thing. Cross them over, crisscross applesauce, up and behind your neck. And we're going to hook it together back here. And then we're going to take... And that's number six. And this is number seven. And number seven. Yay, we did it. Alrighty. So one necklace, one slide, seven different ways. And we just taught you how to be a smart shopper. Now I'm going to point out here another necklace that's right in front of me. Um, over actually in front of Jay Lynn. Um, the Costa Rica necklace. Same style of necklace, but just different colors. Costa Rica has more of the olive tones, a pumpkin. You can wear that with reds. And even up against blues and whites. Um, wonderful for the fall. And then uh, we want to show you the Manhattan necklace. We're going to show you some fun things how you wear, can wear this Manhattan necklace. Very similar to what I just showed you with the crisscross applesauce up and behind. One short, one long. Um, but we're going to show you some other items too. Yeah, you can wear this all those ways. Um, and another way to do it is separate the necklace. You're going to take four strands on each side. Mm -hmm. So you're basically separating it in half and leaving it clasped in the middle. And then you're just going to put that behind your neck. So you have these two sides. And then we're just going to grab these two and tie them in a knot to create a Y necklace. Tassel looks are very popular still too. Yes. So you what? can do that with the Manhattan necklace. And then you can also do you have that? Well I was gonna show you you can twist it. Perfect. And so you're kind of getting the hematite and the silver are kind of um, blending and they're kind of making a striped effect. And what you can do, you can use our safari slide that has the stripes, or you can even go back to the silver swirl slide and add that on there too. Yes. Uh, this adds an extra look. Alright. Let's show them how you can frame it. One long, one short, one with a tassel. 
Oh, that's right. So you can put this one on long, and then you can take, again, you're going to separate out four of the strands, and you can just take these and tie a loose knot in there. <laughs> Voila! So then you have, again, like the tassel look, and then the other one is framing it. Brilliant. Awesome. So those are a few things you can do with a Manhattan necklace. All right. We are just going to point out this necklace right here is called um, Harmony. I love this necklace because I say that moms and daughters can live in harmony wearing this necklace. The reason is, it's actually two necklaces in one. So again, smart shopping. So, wonderful Christmas idea, birthday gifts, Mother Day's, Mother's Day gift, birthdays. You can wear this all together as one, but maybe the daughter says, Mom, I want to wear a necklace. You take one off, and she can wear just a long one. And that's nice and long, very fun. Me and Mom has to go out go grocery shopping. She wants to just put a necklace on to go out to do the groceries, get the groceries, or post office, because you don't have to wear your jewelry just being dressed up. You can be casual. So Harmony is uh, a short necklace and a long necklace, and then again, you can wear this necklace, as we taught before, by separating it in crisscross applesauce, one side short and one long. So the Harmony necklace. Yes. And one more we want to show you that is this, uh, this similar is the Sedona necklace. Just like all the other ones, it's a multi-strand necklace. We also have the uh, Soleil necklace, which is more of the brown tones as well. This one, it has the matte silver, copper, and matte gold. So this one you can wear long. You can also take your clip it and wear it short or doubled, just like that. You can add a pin to this. This is our Notting Hill pin. I love this pin. It's gorgeous. It has the Aurora Borealis crystals, so it adds a little bit of sparkle to the necklace, but you can wear that on there and off to the side. And you can also take your clip it and twist, twist it and clip it together with your clip it. The twisted look is also very pretty. You can, again, you can add the pin right down there to the front, add the bling. And even a slide if you want to put one in a magnetic. Oh yeah, I'll Closure. show that one next. Oh good idea. I was, <laughs> I was getting too excited. <laughs> Jamie really likes jewelry. I know jewelry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, oh, what was I doing? So, again, showing that same idea is you're going to open this up, put it around your neck, you got your clasp and your extender down here, and you're just going to crisscross those two, bring it behind, clip it together. So, again, you have your short and your long layers. And then you can add your magnetic enhancer. This is the Baroque enhancer. It's not Baroque, it's Baroque. Baroque. <laughs> <laughs> so you can do that. Um, and because this necklace does have the copper and the matte gold and matte silver, you can add silver to that as well. You can really wear this necklace with lots of different metals. Don't be afraid to mix and match. You can mix and match. The metals. Awesome. So what we've taught you on this episode, we've given you a lot of great tips in how, again, you can be a smart shopper. Think about CPW, cost per wear. So you look at the one price, but then you break it down, and wow, you are saving a lot of money with one necklace mm -hmm. and a slide. So awesome. So thanks for joining us for Java today with Jamie and Jaylen. <laughs>